you said that you found your voice through writing. When did you realize that you also had such a unique voice physically and, and also figuratively? That was the first thing I think I noticed that people mm-hmm. noticed. People were like, Jesus. The f-? You know? <laughs> my mom was like, my mom was like, what, what is that? What's like, happening? in the car. Like, you know, and I was like, I was really, I was like not. I think I just like let loose one day because I was really quiet about it all the time. I was like, you know, and, yeah. then, uh, and my mother was like, what? Is that you? And I was like, yeah, <laughs> it is. And and when she said that, um, then I started singing out more in yeah. in uh, class, in like chorus class. And then uh, I had this, like really um, eccentric teacher and she was like, who is that? <laughs> and all the kids were like, you know, and uh, and uh, yeah, and then she started putting me in like the you know plays and stuff like that. Oh, and that's then, cool. Yeah, and people were like, "Oh shit," you know, and um, yeah, and then I don't know, it just was like always a thing. And then trying to like rock and roll a little bit, um, you know, like I was like kind of late to like like you know, my mom played a lot of like opera and like kind of like musical theater and shit like that. So I was kind of late to the <clears throat> classic rock thing yeah. you know? and then I started like going like holy shit I, I think when I was like a little kid I heard Janice Shop and I was like oh my god <laughs> what the fuck is that <laughs> turn it down you know like like mugging like you know some like old granny you know I was like uh... and then all of a sudden I was like holy shit <laughs> she's a genius <laughs> 